Hey guys, thanks for taking the time today. My name is Alex. I'm on the ArcSight team over here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to walk you through some of the different tools inside of ArcSight that will really help make you as efficient as possible while you're out in the field. Now, because we're out on site and we're starting to calculate some of this information, I'm going to build exactly what we need for this example. So I can be as quick as possible. I can drag and drop different rooms, whether that be a garage. I can highlight or use some of the digital tools that will bring these lines together. So I can extend these lines by dragging my finger through these. I can add a couple of additional ones. So maybe we've got another wall or line here and we wanna label a couple of these and maybe this is a garage. So as we're doing this, we're collecting a lot of data that is not only helpful for the internal team, but it really starts showing the customer exactly what the scope of work might be. So when you download ArcSight, out of the box, you're gonna have access to uh, about 1400 different shapes. You're also gonna have access to custom windows as soon as you get into the app. So when I'm doing this, I can drag and drop a door or opening in the relevant area that we want to specifically highlight or call out. Now, as we're going around and we're collecting data, we can label different things like we did with the garage. We can make specific callouts. Maybe this is a crawl space that we want to highlight. We can define the entryway size. So maybe this is a three foot entryway. So that way we know what, what equipment we can get into the basement. Now that we've got the, the rough foundation plan drawn out, let's start adding what we call products. Products are gonna be uh, based on your product catalog, your services that you offer, whether that be helical piers, crawl space encapsulations, fumigation, really the gambit of different things that you can do, uh, all the way to labor calculations inside of ArcSight. Now, because we're out on site and I wanna calculate a couple of different things, I have this crawl space that I wanna add. We already called out that this area right down in the bottom middle is going to be my crawl space. So all I need to do, even though we've got some calculated or you know hard to calculate areas due to all the different curved angles or walls, I can tap my finger and it's gonna automatically tell me that that wall or that area is 284 square feet. So when I hit okay and I go back into my estimate, it's gonna confirm some inputs for me, but it's gonna start building the cart of all the different services that we might offer. We have what we call location-based photo. So the location-based photo will allow you to collect that data for relevant areas of the home that the customer might not be aware of. Because I'm not on on-site right now, I am gonna select one for my photo library, and I'm gonna select one for my ArcSight uh, library, and I'm gonna call out some of the different things that we're seeing. Now this might not be a crawl space, but maybe we wanna highlight that we have a big crack along the foundation. I can circle that, make it big, ready, apparent for the customer. So we're gonna repair this crack. So when I go back into the drawing, as soon as I tap on that, everything that I just did will be saved. But now what I can do is I can change exactly where I was looking when I took that photo. We're gonna add a exterior helical pier. When I add that along the wall, and I zoom in, it's, you're gonna see that it's three foot off center from that wall. At, when you move it along this, it's gonna hug specifically to that wall, but it's gonna place it exactly where you need off center. I can tap on this little icon. I can define that I want this to be every six feet or every seven feet or every eight feet. And then what I can do is I can drag my finger up and down and I would have those perfectly spaced out along that wall. Now. The last step of the process is gonna be uh, creating this customer proposal, putting this information together so it creates a flattened PDF that cannot be edited after the fact. We've got our company information, our logo, our client information, and the date that it was evaluated on always gets timestamped. We've got a l full list of our products down to the description. The, how the products and pricing is presented to the customer can be very customized. So we'd love to have a conversation with you about what your existing proposal template looks like and how we can either enhance that or recreate that within ArcSight. We've got a list and a legend of everything that we added, a spot for the customer to sign just by dragging their finger along on the iPad. We also do have e-sign abilities within our web uh, proposal tool. And then any terms and conditions that you wanna add. 
We'd love to have a conversation with how this would look for your business. We do offer a full non-commitment two-week trial that you can really get a good assessment of if this is going to work for your business. Please feel free to reach out to us and we'll look forward to talking to you soon.